Hi, everybody. I'm Michelle Thomas. I'm a medical intuitive energy healer, psychic and transformational coach with Radiant Living and RadiantLivingHLC.com. Welcome to our week ahead forecast, everybody. Happy March 28th. Woo, it's going to be a great week. I hope that you are ready for it. I hope you had a fabulous weekend. Um, so let's get into our week ahead forecast, shall we? So what is the energy surrounding us this week is friendship, friendship. All right. It's time for you to get out of your hidey hole. It's time for you to go back and reconnect with the people that love and care about you. If you've been kind of in hibernation a little bit, it's time. It's springtime. It's time to get back outside. It's time to go and hang out with your friends. It's time to even like maybe join a new group, um, make some new friends. Um, but it's really about making connections this week. So try and have, find some time to spend with those people that you really love and trust um, and reawaken that connection with others because we're not meant to be an island. So get out of hibernation. Springtime is here. It's time for you to re um, enter society um, and really bolster those relationships that you have. Um, so what are some obstacles? Interesting enough is good luck. Good luck. So what does that really mean as an obstacle? Um, it means that you need to make sure that you're paying attention to those coincidences, those serendipitous moments um, that are that are moving towards you right now. Don't miss the opportunity that's right in front of your nose, right? Good fortune, good luck, all these things are coming towards you. And if you're not paying attention at all, you're going to miss them. So keep your eyes open for beautiful new blessings that are coming into your life that the universe is trying to bring you. Um, because again, opportunity only knocks a few times. So pay attention, embrace the opportunities, the opportunities for any kind of change, new projects, new beginnings, new relationships, right? Because our energy is all about friendship. So embrace those new things and don't miss them, right? Pay attention, be mindful so that when something appears like magic, it's not really magic, the universe has it your back. So what are some things that we, uh, some actions that we can take as well is commitment, commitment, commitment. You need to be committed, right? To not only your dreams and goals, but be committed to um, receiving, right? Blessings to giving back to society, being committed to your soul's growth. Um, it's time for you to get a little bit more focused and determined this week um, so that you're not feeling distracted and you need to, you need to get a little more focused. Um, like last week was all about strategy. This week is really about taking those steps, being committed to your improvement in whatever way that is. And funny enough, um, our spirit's guidance for us is well-being, right? So being committed, right? If you're working towards a health, um, you know, your better health, and wellness, whether that be mental, emotional, spiritual, or physical wellness, focus on that. Be committed to making yourself uh, in, in better or improved in whatever way sits with you. Um, so I hope you have a fantastic week. And if you have not signed up for my chakra three-day intensive, I hope you join me. It's going to be a fabulous three days. The event will take place in a private Facebook group, as well as replays will be available through email um, and a YouTube link. Um, and so uh, I can't wait to share this. We're going to get, dive really deep into not only the seven main chakras that live within our body, but we're also going to talk about our soul star, which lives outside in our etheric body, as well as our earth star. And I'm going to be talking about all of them and how they affect our physical body, our emotional body, all the ways that they can get stuck and out of balance. So we're going to talk about all of that. We're going to reclaim right our power. Not only that, but every single day will end with a chakra clearing as well as a healing chakra meditation to help us rebalance all of the chakras. So every day I'm going to talk about three different chakras and each day we're going to clear all the crap that's sitting in there with you. Um, so I hope you will join me. Stop at my website, radiantlivinghlc.com slash chakra, the number three and day, and you can register and sign up. I can't wait to share this event with you and I hope you have a fantastic week. Thank you.